Yo, 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 what's up, what it do, what it do? It's your boy Lou from the Lou. What's that? It was cracking, was shaking, was popping. All that, all that. Hope y'all had a good night, you know. Hope everybody got everything accomplished, did what you were supposed to do. Um, last night was pretty wild. You know, y'all probably heard the news, seen the news. Um, if not, you was out there in it. But last night, it was a gun battle on 270. And it's crazy, because I was just crossing um west Florida and overpass over 270 and i seen how and i seen the police and i seen the street blocked off i'm like damn they working on the highway because all i seen was like the highway patrol truck or something but i ain't you know and they had it blocked off far too so i'm like damn they got the whole street blocked off i'm thinking they working on it i ain't really paid no attention to it um but i get up and see that it was a gun a shootout on the highway man we done had a few of these in like the past, what, five years, man? We done had like, man, about 10 at least, you know, shootouts on the highway. And it's crazy because, like I say, St. Louis is small, population under 400,000. And we are only, the city is may, maybe from, from city to county, you could drive around from the county to the city in a good hour. You know what I'm saying? I could start out at uh, Winsville, Chesterfield. I could drive all the way through hit downtown and back out hour, hour and a half, maybe two at the most. I'm done riding through the whole city. With that being said, I'm gonna see everybody I had a problem with. If I hit the right gas stations, turn the right corner, stop at the right stores, I'm gonna see the dude I had a problem with, you know what I'm saying? And that's the thing about our city. We not as big, we don't have a lot of area, you know? We don't have a lot of land. It's a lot of open land in the middle of Missouri, but we ain't going out there. You know, we're not as big as state, you know, large mass-wise as California or Texas. So, you get into it with a brother in St. Louis, you know, we're not finna go in Winsville because that's not our city. That's not a major city. We're not finna go hide in St. Peter's and lay low out there. It's not a major city. That's not our part of town, you know. So, we we in St. Louis, the city and the county. That's, that's where we roam. That's where we at. So, you guaranteed to see somebody that you had an issue with. Now, you guys see somebody had an issue with My thing about the gun violence is, I know people got guns. You're going to have guns to protect your house. Hey, that's cool. That's normal. I don't disagree with it. But the thing is, when you pull that thing out and you get to shooting, if you're not at the gun range, if you don't know what you're doing, you're not going to hit your target. You're going to hit everything around it. You know what I'm saying? So you got to consider that you shooting at the body on the highway and trying to shoot them. I know it's beef and drama, and you're like, man, I'm going to take this dude head off. First, you just take a breather before you try to do that and think, like, hey, man, there's other people around, okay? It may be kids in the court, you know? Shit, I get caught for shooting this brother. I'm going to jail for life. You got to think of all these things, you know what I'm saying? I know it's a split-second decision, and the police say that they got a split-second decision also. But understand, we not trying to go against the police. You see what I'm saying? So... Their thought process of saying, hey, it's a life or death, I'm going to have to kill you, is totally different than ours. See, our thought process is about literally survival. You know what I'm saying? Even if you get up and go to a 9 to 5. Some of us are in conditions and just the area we brought up, no matter where you at, put it that way, you're still subject to some kind of criminalization or violence, especially if you're not in that element. If you're not in that mind state and used to being around them, characters or being in that surrounding you're not looking for that you see what i'm saying so if you ride on the highway and some brothers next to you get to shooting you gonna freak out if you're not used to this shit you might crash you might get shot you see what i'm saying other people around are not used to these type of actions so you have to kind of be a little quick on your toes when shit like this arrives if you got beef with a brother man you already know the deal it's gonna be on on site that's the st louis thing it's on site in St. Louis. And like I said, it's not as big. So you can't, if you got that much static in the loop, you can't lay low in another part of town. We can't be like, hey, baby, I'll be back and go lay low in Winsville for two, three weeks until the smoke lie down. Because they don't know you in Winsville. They're like, who is this nigga? They gonna call the police on you out there. You see what I'm saying? It's not, we're not able to move around as easy as they are in the bigger states and bigger cities. So when you got this drama with a nigga, and you gonna see this nigga, you gotta be prepared. You see what I'm saying? Because you don't know how he coming. And them shootouts on the highways, man, them are very dangerous. 
very dangerous. So I want y'all to think about pulling them pistols out and get some dumping on them highways, man, because I'm driving on the highway and a nigga already put a hole in my car because I rolled past him. Shoo, nigga shot my car. Bop. I didn't know what the fuck it was. I thought I blew a tire. Before I got home, I had a fucking bullet hole in my fucking car. You hear me? Yeah. Um, on some other note, y'all be safe out there in these streets, man. It's getting hot. You know, that, that beef was chilling through the pandemic and through the, through the winter time. Niggas lay low, but they ain't forgot about that drama. You know what I'm saying? So just make sure y'all stay safe and stay dangerous. You know what I'm saying? For real. And like I said, it's a beautiful day to stay alive out there. So, so don't catch them murders and don't catch no life sentences. Straight up. It's your boy Lou from the Lou, man. I love you. Peace.